Henry Cavill's getting pretty good at signing autographs now. It may not be New York or London, but this red carpet means more for the boy from St. Michael's. It's incredibly important for me. Um, it's actually really brought it home. I mean, I've been in New York, I've been in Mexico City, I've been in London, and arriving here and seeing all of this has really brought it home to me that how special this is and how big an event. Of course, you went to school in Jersey. Is that where the passion for acting started, playing Joseph in the Nativity or similar? Uh, yeah, actually, it is. Um, and it, it's kind of fun to be back here and at the end of a very long journey, or the start of a new part of my journey, um, all thanks to Jersey. Adding even more showbiz stardust to proceedings were Henry's co-stars, Oscar winner Russell Crowe and Oscar nominee Amy Adams, both old hands at working a crowd. Well, this Jersey premiere was meant to start at about a quarter to seven. It's now about a quarter past seven. As you can tell, Henry Cavill is taking to his superstar status like a duck to water, and the fans here, well, they're pretty pleased. It was actually a chance meeting with Crowe years ago that cemented Henry Cavill's acting ambitions. I was at um, a school called Stowe, which Henry attended, uh, just north of London. They were making a movie in 2000 called Proof of Life. And Henry came up and uh, chatted to me between shots and asked me uh, how he should go about becoming an actor. So, you know, uh, there was just something in his eyes that made me treat his uh, questions seriously. And, you know, I told him, it's up to you. You know, nobody gives you anything. Nobody's going to create something for you. You know, it's up to your persistence. And if you want to do it, then you'll find a way to do it, you know. And he's doing pretty well so far, according to the new Lois Lane. He's a wonderful person, and I think he's, uh, he has enough humility and uh, enough of a genuine personality to, to embrace this new part of his life. Henry Cavill may be a man of steel, and he's certainly a man of the people. But tonight proved, above all, he's a family man, as the whole Cavill clan turned out in force to support him and got the biggest cheer of the night.